Hi everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're gonna to be factoring fast facts. And what I mean by that is I'm gonna be giving you polynomials that you should be able to factor just by looking at it within 10 seconds or less. We're gonna have five trinomials to factor, five perfect square trinomials to factor, and five difference of squares, those binomials that we're gonna be factoring. And I'm gonna give you 10 seconds for each one. So I strongly suggest you watch through the whole video you follow along, you play along, don't pause, that's cheating, unless you have to, you know, go to the bathroom. Otherwise, play along with me and see how you do, and then see if you can watch it again and do even better. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to be factoring are trinomials in this form of x squared plus bx plus c. Very simple, a is just one, so you're just looking at what factor pairs of c add up to b. And you can see above me, there's gonna be a timer, that timer is gonna go off and you're gonna have 10 seconds to answer. And then I'm gonna show the results. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay. Go for it. X squared plus six X plus eight. Did you get it? X plus two, X plus four. Two and four have a sum of two, uh, six and two and four have a product of eight. Next one. You got it? Hey, okay, hopefully you answered positive four, negative one. They have a sum of positive three and a product of negative four. Next one. X squared minus eight plus eight X plus 12. Time's up, x minus two, x minus six. Next one, x squared minus nine x minus 10. Negative 10, positive one. And our last trinomial like this, x squared plus eight x minus 20. So you're thinking what multiplies to get a negative 20 that adds up to get eight. I hope you got it. Positive 10, negative two. Now, next round, perfect square trinomials. So the perfect square trinomials are where we have this trinomial, x squared plus bx plus c, and our c value is a perfect square. And the square root of c doubled gives me b, okay? Hopefully you remember your perfect square trinomials. If not, take a look at my perfect square trinomial video. Let's see if we can factor these. Your answer should be a binomial squared, okay? Like x plus one squared. Let's see how we do. Ready? We've got five problems. Go. x squared plus eight x plus 16. Easy one. Should be x plus four squared. Four doubles to get eight and it squares to get 16. Next one x squared minus 6x plus 9. Done. x minus 3 squared. Negative 3 doubles to get negative 6, and it squares to get positive 9. Next one. x squared plus 10x plus 25. Easy one. This is easy. Time's up x plus five squared, five doubles to get 10 and squares to get 25. x squared minus 12 x plus 36. Times up, x minus six squared. I hope we did well on that. Last one, x squared plus four x plus four. Times up x plus two squared. Two doubles to get four and it squares also to get four. Our last five fast facts are going to be for differences of squares. So our differences of squares are that special binomial where it's a perfect square minus a perfect square. And the way we factor it, the way we would factor x squared minus y squared is that it would be x plus y, x minus y. So it's the square root of the first term, square root of the last term, one gets a plus, one gets a minus five problems for us and that wraps up our wraps up our factoring fast facts ready 
x squared minus 4. Square root of each, 1 gets a plus, 1 gets a minus. x plus 2, x minus 2. Okay, square root of x squared is x, square root of 4 is 2, 1 gets a plus, 1 gets a minus. Next one, x squared minus 81. Always looking for patterns. We're taking the previous problem to answer this one. x plus 9, x minus 9. Next one, x squared minus 25. Should be getting the hang of the pattern now at this point. Should see it. Okay, x plus 5, x minus 5. Next one, 4x squared minus 49. So remember, square root of the first term, square root of the last term, 1 gets a plus, 1 gets a minus. 2x plus 7, 2x minus 7. Square root of 4x squared is 2x, square root of 49 is 7. So that's why I get this result. Last one, guys, 9x squared minus 25. And time's up. 3x plus 5, 3x minus 5. Thank you so much for joining me on this video. I hope this was helpful for you. Good idea would be to go back to the beginning, replay it again, and see if you could do even better. Thanks, guys.